This 10 News Pinpoint Weather Report is sponsored by Anderson Plumbing, Heating and Air. Nobody wows clients like we do. And ABC 10 News Pinpoint Meteorologist Leah Pizzetti joining us with a look at our weekend. How's it looking for Dad tomorrow? Dad, you know, it's going to be a little toasty for you. <laughs> we are still continuing to track excessive heat. It's been a hot week and we do still have a little bit more heat to get through. So yeah, happy Father's Day for all you father figures out there for tomorrow. Get ready for a little bit of heat. Right now, though, temperatures are fairly mild across the board. We see a lot of 70s. San Diego sitting at 71 degrees right now. Poway 77, Mission Valley 72. Ramona a little bit toasty, 83 degrees. Chula Vista a little bit cooler, 67 degrees right now. Live look at our Del Mar Sky Camera right now. You see a little bit of gloom on the horizon out there, but that's not stopping people from enjoying the beach right now. Uh, same thing tomorrow. We are going to wake up to a little bit of a marine layer. It's starting to build right now, and then it is going to continue into tonight doesn't look to hang on too long tomorrow, uh, so it should be pretty nice tomorrow, especially as these temperatures warm on up along the coast. If you're heading out for Father's Day, maybe to celebrate the beginning of summer tomorrow evening is our summer solstice. Uh, it's going to be fairly nice along the coast. We do have some 60s La Jolla looking at 69 degrees, uh, but 70s for our coastal communities for tomorrow as we move inland. That's where it's nice and toasty. That's where the heat is continuing 80s and 90s, uh, even nearing triple digits. Warner Springs getting up to 96 degrees for tomorrow in our desert communities definitely going to feel the heat 120 degrees expected in Ocotillo Wells. We've been seeing this record breaking heat this past couple days and that is going to continue into tomorrow. We do still have this excessive heat warning in place. It actually has now been extended everywhere in this pink zone. So really everywhere except for the coast is under this excessive heat warning still we do think it's going to end tomorrow evening 9 p.m. This excessive heat warning should end, but warm temperatures are going to stick around for a few more days before we get a little bit of a break. Uh, so along our coast, it's going to stay fairly temperate, fairly mild, a little bit above average to start the week, but we do cool down closer to average midweek, staying in the 70s for the next seven days. For our inland communities, it's going to be a nice bell curve. We're starting in the upper 80s, Father's Day tomorrow. Uh, it's going to be nice and sunny, warm for you, cooling down to the lower 80s, closer to our seasonal norms midweek, but then we warm right back up by the end of the week. So by next Saturday, another hot weekend in store. For our mountain communities, same thing. We're starting in those mid to upper 80s. We do get down into the upper 70s by midweek. So midweek is going to be a little bit of a break from the heat before warming back up to the 90s by the end of the week. For our desert communities, like I said, we have been breaking records right and left. A couple more days of the heat back down to closer to seasonal norm and then we warm right back up. So a little bit of everything yeah. for everyone. And tomorrow uh, is the official start of summer, summer solstice. Yep, here we go. All right. Thanks, Leah.